Why does every guy cheat on you? Trust me, I know. How come girls always call you their friend? I can tell you. We'll talk about your strength and we'll talk about emotions. Secrets of Birthdays, now live for purchase. Check out yours at secretsofbirthdays.com. Hello innovators, welcome now to Thursday and thanks for logging in Aquarius. Well today I think it's sunny, but you're nesting and resting. The moon is now off of the Grand Trine in Earth and your emotions now want to settle, want to ground themselves and that's what you want to do today is self-nurture and ground yourself. This is an excellent day to clean your house. I always tell people clean your house during this transit, you'll feel so much better, you'll feel fabuloso. If you guys know what that is, that's my favorite cleaning product, by the way. But it is a day really to ground. If you're finding yourself kind of scattered, it's because you need to do better self-nurturing. So take good care of yourself. Now zip into that sun. We're now in chapter three of Sun in Gemini. There's no ruling planet today. So today is a day to hold space with what you know so far. As you know, the Aquarius this month are trying to root back to joy in their life. Find the joy in your life. Find the romance in your life. Find the spontaneous creativity in your life. And in that effort, how far are you? Do you feel joyful today? Do you see joy around the corner? Hold space and try to walk the earth in that state of joy if you can. See where it breaks down, see what challenges you, see what you need to do next. And that's what chapter three is about and we start really that with the work tomorrow. And I've got some shitty news. Pluto is squaring Jupiter Uranus in Aries. That means we're gonna have some pretty decent fear coming up between two areas of our life and conflicts, fear and conflict. In your case, it's between having faith in yourself, which you're trying to figure out how to do now. You're reworking faith in yourself. What will it take for you to have faith in the universe, in yourself, being comfortable in your own skin? I'm seeing a lot of Aquariuses kind of wigged out everywhere right now, having a hard time in that regard. And then squaring Jupiter, Uranus, and Aries, which is uh, encouraging you to expand and innovate your intellect. So a narrow mind leads to a lack of faith. A lack of faith leads to a narrow mind. And the fears and the conflicts between the two need to be resolved. Now you'll probably have the most profound change when it comes to your attitude and your narrow mindedness. And I know what you're thinking Aquarius. I'm an Aquarius, I always see the big picture, I always see the greater picture. Yeah, but your day to day thoughts are probably repetitive and in a rut. Okay, so your own thoughts need to innovate and expand. And it's Thursday. We have Sadiqa Zalter, our renegade aromatherapist, going live today. Her final Gemini chapter, recommending a plant in the plant kingdom to you that will help you in your case with bringing back that joy. So don't miss Sadiqa. She can help you and so can the plant. She's live everywhere in the garden. All right, Aqua, that wraps up Thursday. Tomorrow I'm back to talk about emotional clarity and I have your full weekend forecast. Until Friday, live, love, be. So God.